Welcome back to The Body Coach TV and welcome to the very first workout filmed in my new home. This is my new gym, I've got my dumbbells and kettlebells and I'm just buzzing to get going to start sharing more content with you to get you fitter, stronger and also happier. You know, that's the aim of my channel, I want to make you feel good. And today's workout is going to make me feel fantastic if you stick with me and finish it. It's a 30 minute workout using one set of dumbbells. I've got a pair of 10 kilograms. You could go lighter or heavier depending on your strength and just try and follow all the way through 35 seconds of work 25 seconds rest and it's three rounds in total so straight through 30 minutes first exercise picking up the dumbbells you can either hold one dumbbell and um, close to your chest like this if you want to do a front squat with one or if you want to go a bit heavier pick up both dumbbells and you're going to go in for a front squat you sit down nice and low stand up tall so your choice starting five seconds front squat for 35 seconds let's go so down and up good controlled squats Nice straight back, weight in the heels, and drive through those heels as you stand up. So it's 35 seconds on, 25 seconds rest. And I'm using the same set of dumbbells all the way through, 10 seconds on the clock. Drive those knees out, last couple of reps. And relax, but you could also have a lighter set and a heavier set if you want to do a five kilogram set and a 10 kilogram, whatever it may be. So, second exercise, we're going into a kind of high plank position from here and we're going to row. So, it's one and down, two and down. Keeping those abs engaged, you're going to feel it in your core, but also your upper back. Let's go. So, one, row. If you don't have the strength for that, you can do the same thing from your knees. So just bring that weight towards the hip, thinking about the muscles in your upper back as you squeeze that dumbbell up and also keeping your abs tight. Don't rock your hips, so don't rock left to right like this. Keep your hips square onto the ground, pull and down. Slow and controlled. Really pull up high. And relax, fantastic. Right. Next exercise is a burpee curl into a press. So, a bit of a naughty one. Basically, you're gonna start with this. So you do your burpee, you come up, curl, and press. So it's hands down, you go one, two, come up, curl, and press. Off we go. So it's burpee, come up. Curl and press. So you can do it in one kind of fast movement. One, two, and up. Just get those dumbbells above the head. Nice straight arms right above the head. Curl, press, good. Same again. Let's go. So we go down, out, up, come up, curl, press. And relax. Well done. So putting those weights down. Next exercise is going to be reverse lunges. So nice straight back, like so. And you're going to reverse lunge, holding the dumbbells. 35 seconds of work, 25 seconds rest. It's a tough workout, full body. Let's go. So step. Brilliant. Your chest up, shoulders back. Think about really working your legs as you bend those knees. So really drop down low. Come on. Good work. Slow reps, control it. Straight back, drive through that front heel. Last few seconds. Five on the clock. And relax, well done, right. Waist down on the ground. And now we're going to press up number five. So you can press up from the knees, elbows tucked in, like this. Or you can do full push ups, same thing, elbows tucked in. As many as you can in 35 seconds. Let's go. So don't rush, slow and press. Slowly lower. 
Control and press. Blow on and push. Good. Squeeze those abs as well when you're doing this. Think about your abs having to work. Keeping that strong plank. Squeeze the glutes. Squeeze the abs. Press. 15 seconds on the clock. Slow control. Good. Elbows tucked in. Press. Elbows tucked in. Oh, press. Okay, one more good push up. Oh, much harder when you tuck those elbows in and sort of flaring the elbows out. And also slowing it down just makes it so much tougher. Okay, so picking up the dumbbells. Next exercise is going to be bicep curls. Um, I'm going to do them both at the same time. So curl and down. Nice straight back. Elbows tucked in again. Let's go. So rotate from there. Arms face you. So control on the way down as well. And pull. Don't just kind of swing up and use momentum. Like really slow it down. Squeeze those biceps. Come on. Squeeze and lower. Good. Really think about the muscle you're working on. Contract those biceps. Come on, squeeze. And relax. Right. Next exercise, number six. Sorry, number seven is a squat jump. So a little bit more explosive. We're going to land nice and soft. And then spring up off the ground for 35. You're going to feel the burn in these legs now. Are you ready for it? Let's go. So land nice and softly. Spring up. That's it. Good. Jump. If you can't do the jumps, just do normal squats. But if you can, get that explosive power. Come on. Big jump, 15 seconds left. Let's work. Land nice and soft. Spring up. It burns. Five seconds. Ouch. Shake them off. Number eight, down on the ground. We're gonna do, so two exercises in one. We're gonna do a skull crush, which is basically you bring your elbows, you, you lower the thumbs off the ground, straighten, and then press. So, tricep extension, and then a bit narrow, press. Tricep extension, narrow, Press, tricep extension, slow, squeeze. Think about your chest and triceps now. So bend the elbows, keep them fit from there, and you straighten the arms using those triceps. Push and repeat. Ooh. Elbows tucked in, press. Last one. Oh. You feel that in the triceps, and the old bingo wing, right. Oh, next one, another toughie, is a thruster. Now, this is number nine. So, dumbbells up, we squat down like this, and come up, and push up, thrust. Oh. Let's go, down, and up, down, and up, good. Explode, and then just get into a bit of a rhythm. So you go from there to there, to there, kick through, centre, kick, centre, kick, good, kick, 
Come back to that, like, all fours position. Kick through, back, kick through, back, kick through, back. <sighs> oh, it's tough. Tough on the shoulders, tough on the abs. <sighs> kick through. Turn up my legs off the ground, come back to centre, and kick. Kick. One more. Ah. Oh, wow. That's hard. One round complete, two more to go. Oh, that's hard. Shoulders are gone. Okay. Front squats. Picking up the weights. Let's go. Let's go. If you find your shoulders have gone mine already gone, weights by your side. Alternate squat. Shoulders are cooked. This is really hard already. Okay. Oh, my shoulders. All right, high plank, and let's row, row. Keeping those abs tight, gap between the legs, pull the weight up towards the hips. Think about squeezing the muscles in your upper back. Pull. Good. This really challenges your core. If it's too difficult, you could also do body weight where you sort of go from there. Try and make it a little bit easier. You've got seven seconds on the clock. Wow. Out. Next exercise, number three, is the burpee curl press. So it's going to be the burpee, hands and the weights kick out. Here we go. So we kick out, come up, curl, and press. Good. Curl and press. It's actually easy if you go wider with the dumbbells and let your feet land in the middle. So go a bit wider with the dumbbells. Feet land in the middle, look up, squat. Curl, press. And burpee. Look up, squat, curl, press. And. Savage. Savage. Right. Next exercise. Reverse lunges. So if you can't handle the two dumbbells, you want to hold one. One to the chest. Lunge. Oh, lunge, lunge. So you have two dumbbells, pull the one. Let's go. Reverse lunge. Back nice and straight. Try to look the back knee towards the ground. And then drive up through that front leg. Oh, this is a workout. This is a workout. Keep going. Work the legs, come on. Number five, after this is gonna be push ups. Come on. One set of dumbbells, one, one savage workout. Very little rest, super effective. So, number five is push ups. Right, as many as you can in 35 seconds. Let's go. Okay. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. 
two, and then slow rate. Chest hits the floor, and not push up. Straighten your arms. And as I'm doing this, I'm thinking about keeping my abs tight. I don't want to dip my back like this. Strong abs, strong core, you're holding your plank as you push and lower. Hold that plank, hold it over there, hold those abs tight. Ooh. Ah. Okay, next up, bicep curls. So if you feel like the weight's too light, it's time to increase it. If it's too heavy, you can obviously drop set, drop down a little bit. You want to, you want to be struggling. The last, you know, three or four, you want to be feeling it. You want to be feeling this, you know, feel the effort. Okay, let's go. So you curl, rotate from there to there. Oh. Savage. That's it, good. Rotate, 20 seconds on the clock. Think about the biceps working now. Really, really focus on the elbows. Close to the body. Come and lower. Come on. Squeeze. Slowly lower. Last few seconds. Oh. Ow. Next up, number seven is squat jumps. Let's do it. Let's finish this. I know it's not easy, but let's finish it. So jumps. 35 seconds. Land nice and soft. Explode up. That's it. Nice deep breath. Big jumps. Ah. Ah, 10 seconds. Come on, jump. Five, last few seconds. Oh. Okay, on the ground. Oh. So, now we're going to start with a narrow press and then a tricep extension. Narrow press, so elbows tucked in, push straight up, elbows locked in that position, bend the elbow, lower the weight, feel the triceps load, and then squeeze those triceps to push those dumbbells back up. So, slow rep control there. Slowly low, feel your triceps working now. I'm not bringing my elbows back, I'm keeping them fixed just there. And from there, push. Ah, that's a great exercise for the back of the arms. Whoa, really good exercise. All right, I'm going back into the thrusters. So you squat down, and with the weight, you press them up above the head. Oh. Explosive, lots of muscles being used. 20 seconds. Come on, come on. One more. Middle, kick through. So you don't need, 
Your bum doesn't hit the ground, your legs off the ground, you can feel your core, your core and your abs are working. Centre and kick. Centre and then kick that leg through. Oh, what an exercise. What an exercise. And you can go a bit quicker if you want. One. Oh. Oh. Okay, well done, two rounds, one to go. Last 10 minutes, don't give up on me, don't quit. Let's finish this round. Okay, squats. Let's go. Last round, front squats. Roll the dumbbell towards your hips, put it right into the body. This is a great session, honestly. Well done. Well done. Okay, let's go. So pull, lower, pull, lower. Squeeze it out when you do this. Squeeze, lower. Think about your core. Think about your abs doing the work. When you lift that weight to the ground, this has to work so hard to stabilize. Slowly control it. Slow. No more of them. No more of them. Right. Burpee, curl, press. Oh, this is a sick workout, man. This is proper. So we're going to go wide with the dumbbells, kick back, come up, curl and press. Let's go straight down. Burpee, come up, look straight up, straight back. Squat, curl, press. And repeat. As many as you can. In that time frame, 20 seconds left. Go and press. Whoa. 10 seconds. Come. One more rep. Reverse lunges. Let's go. Reverse lunge. Big steps. Big steps. Big steps. Come on. Let's go, one. 
Now we've tucked in and press. Now we've tucked in and press. Look, control the way down slow. Pause and push. Last set. 10 seconds. Abs tight. Come on. Chest and triceps now. Big push. One more push. Last breath. <sighs> Nearly at failure there, like proper muscular fatigue there. All right, we're getting up now for number six, which is bicep curls. Five more moves, five minutes, stay with me. <sighs> if you want to kneel for this, you can kneel. <sighs> Same thing. <sighs> oh. <sighs> Come on, 35 seconds on each exercise. Well done for sticking with me through this session, it's not been easy. Let's go, go. Go. Everything's controlled, even on the way down. Not, I'm not just dropping them and swinging them up. I'm thinking about the lowering phase as well. So contract, slowly, slowly lower. Stretch the muscle and contract, lengthen. Last one. Oh, they feel over in 10 now. They feel heavier. Oh. Oh. Next up, squat jumps. Great effort. Seriously, seriously tough work. So this is a tough section. I'm struggling with it. Right, squat jump number seven. Let's go. Okay, so. Land softly, and we spring up. Land, spring, explode. I'm not just using my hips and hinging from there. I'm really bending my legs, like straight back, look straight ahead. Make your legs do hard. Legs work, come on. Power in the legs now. Hop off the ground next time. Three more moves. Heart rate is just insane. What? 170 beats per minute. All right. Oh. Let's go. So narrow press. Tricep extension. Narrow press. Slow, controlled tricep, bend the elbows, and, and then straighten. Elbows tucked in, press, bend. Uh, elbows tucked in, press, bend. Oh. Oh. Last rep. I'm glad that one's over. I'm covered in sweat. Absolutely drenched. Right. So there's no AC up here, it's just pure heat. Just I'm in the loft, so it's like I've got to get the windows open. Okay. Next up is the thrusters. Last set. So come down. Up. Come on, last set. Powerful thrusters. Drive up. Get that really strong front squat. And as you come up, thrust. Ah, legs are absolutely gone. Come on, Joy. Come on. Last few seconds. Five on the clock. Get them away from me. That's why in so many muscles that exercise. Ah. Okay. Last set of kick throughs, final exercise. Okay, so from there, we kick our foot through, center, and kick. All to turn to that 
Position there. Both hands on, kick through, hands on the ground, kick through. And if you look, I'm trying to keep my bum and leg off the ground the whole time. You're really tight your core, your upper body strength. 10 seconds left, come on. Last exercise. Five seconds. Come on, finish on the high. One more. Oh, what a workout. 30 minutes, very little rest, one set of dumbbells. And we've smashed it, legs, shoulders, chest, back, abs, everything. Great session, I hope you enjoyed it. If you wanna have, you know, longer workouts with kettlebells, dumbbells, you know, I can do 45 minutes to an hour if you want. So let me know in the comments below what type of workouts you wanna see more of. And I look forward to sharing them here on the Body Coach TV. Thanks again for subscribing. Please tell your friends and family about the channel. And let's get the whole world working out at home and feeling good. Thanks a lot, see you soon.